I really do with right now. And if you look, look just you look at yesterday, the Dow uh, lost 69 points. It closed at 20,856. So it wasn't a great day. Now we started off higher yesterday after the ADP jobs report showed 298,000 new jobs created in February. That was much better than the 200,000 we expected. Uh, but a big sell-off in oil later in the day took the market down. So not the best day yesterday. So it's been a been a great run. I have a dear friend of mine who has property down in South Alabama, and it's enough that they actually have found oil on the property. But he said the oil companies are not doing much, if anything, right now because of the price of oil is too low. It's not economically feasible for them to drill. No, it, 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 it's not. You know, and, and yesterday oil, oil sold off two hundred and eighty-six cents a fifty twenty-eight a barrel. You know, on another build-up in oil inventories. A 5% drop was the biggest drop in oil in over a year and comes after nine straight weeks of bigger inventories. Uh, the build yesterday took our supplies to 528 million barrels. OPEC has been saying for months they're cutting supply, but we are still sitting with record amounts of oil, and that's going to continue to push the price of oil down. What's going on with Samsung anyway? Uh, the world's largest maker of smartphones, TVs, and memory chips plans to boost its presence in the U.S., now, for decades, they've been building plants here in the U.S. and have been one of the biggest direct foreign investors here. They plan to spend $300 million and add about 500 jobs. Mm. The market, eight years ago today, I, I was just talking about it a moment ago with you. What do you say? Well, it's kind of crazy. Like eight years ago today, the market hit a bottom after falling 57% from its peak. Four years later, on March 28, 2013, the market hit a new high. And today we are up over 200% from the bottom and up 50% from the prior peak set back in 2007. Uh, it's been a wild run. Investors that did not panic and sell have been rewarded very well. So, Time to uh, pull out Scott Carruthers' magic eight ball for the market today. There you go. Today the Dow looked off, eight, lost off 25 points. Uh, we get an update from the ECB as well as first-time job list claims this morning. Tomorrow we get the big employment report and expect 210,000 new jobs created. So we'll see how those numbers come out and see if we can turn this market around. Scott, have a good day, and thanks for the time this morning. Thanks, hey, thanks, Doug. You have a good day. Thank you. Scott Carruthers from Stiefel joined.